your childhood dialogues with the landscape, I believe now, are a memory or an echo or a longing inside that comes from the language of Eden way back then. Um, I believe that Eden still haunts gardens and haunts the earth and the botanic studies that I have begun developing over the last few years since I was in college were like a light bulb moment for me, I guess. That memory of Eden is something that goes way beyond my lifetime. Something that was lost and has been restored. A memory that's more than just a feeling, but a, a deep down seeing, a being, something that seemed to be missing. And this is what I want to examine and explore in the life of a seed, that life that's invisible but yet causes a seed to die and a new life to spring from it. There was always that connection I felt with, with the life of the landscape, those earliest childhood dialogues with the landscape that touched my soul, something like a DNA that keeps drawing me back.